if you really wanted a, a wonder box you could go you know you could actually just get your own by you know um buying a, a separate amp a separate pedal and you know that would be that wouldn't it so anyway i think i've pretty much said what i've got to say i just want to summarize what the game plan is so like i said true seekers is getting known now but i don't want it known for the wrong reasons it's going to go like this true seekers is first and I'm going to get back to this format, bringing you legit evidence. If you are a YouTuber and you've got the Truth Seekers backing, you know what you're watching is real. Okay, that's the first thing. We're going to get back into that. My videos are now going to be more doing a spirit box session pretty much every day or every other day or whatever, you know. Uh, this is if you bought the spirit box and what you might get. Might, you know, whether you want to buy one or not, you might think uh, it's not worth it, you know. Sometimes he gets good contact just to hear the word devil or demon. Great. Or maybe you think, oh, you know, that's up to you, innit? Just watch the video, see what you think. Um, Check this thing's recording, it is. Just, fuck it, it cut out on me a second ago. Um, so the next thing is, no more ousting of frauds. The only time you're going to be ousted is if you are in Truth Seekers and you put up a video that is clearly uh, fake. We will approach you and say, hey, this video we think is fake. Uh, and that's a big no-no in our group, it's an instant dismissal thing. Can you give us evidence uh, to, to back up that it's not fake? And if you don't cooperate or you can't produce the evidence, then you'll be kicked out of Truth Seekers and a public video will go up. It's the only time you're going to be ousted, because that's the contract, you come into Truth Seekers, you are under that, uh, under our, you know, rules if you like. You'll be, you know, this, and it won't be like a big witch hunt, it'll just be, this person's been kicked out of Truth Seekers because they could put up a video that we think is fake, and we've asked for evidence to, on the contrary, or, or you know, some cooperation for them to explain themselves, and they haven't cooperated. So that's why they're not in Truth Seekers. We don't endorse them anymore. Simple as that. Bump gone. Regarding Slimy Furtless, Slimy Furtless. Unless they're playful, like Scotty Fox. I love Scotty Fox. Uh, I also love Speed Armor. Frank Dribble. I'm slowly warming to you, but you're a fucking idiot. Oh, Leslie Nelson. Fucking terrible. Unless it's playful, I will not be talking back, retaliating. Um, you're literally going to get one comment if it so people know so if you write if someone writes oh yeah you know or whatever if someone writes a thing you're going to get one reply from me slimy thirdless that's it that's all you're going to get slimy thirdless your comment would just be marked as slimy thirdless and i ain't going to retaliate you can put many comments after the slimy thirdless as you want i'm not going to retaliate simple if someone puts a video up of me faking my stuff saying i'm a fake i'm a fraud i'm this that, and the other that's fine i won't retaliate but what i will do is someone goes hey i saw a video of you the other day uh they're saying that your dinosaur's fake, or, or, or you lay your audio, or you jump cut, or, or whatever the, the, the fucking uh, thing is. I can explain to you. Certainly, you ask me any question you want. I'm always open to asking questions, because it's obvious I don't fake. Come on, man. Fucking camera's just press record, you know? I it. nothing's set up. But, you know, that's fine. If you want to ask questions, certainly. Be my guest. Uh, I'm open. That's the whole point. Uh, what else can we summarise? Get to the point. Um... That's pretty much it, really. Miss your cat. Come back soon because your live streams are great. And you, Cat Angel's caught some fucking amazing things live. Uh, I mean, that Shadow Man that Wayne caught. Fuck me. That was as good as my photo, but in video, you know, that's fucking awesome. So I hope she comes back soon, you know. But, but yeah, as far as any person that has fake just the once, they cannot come to Truth Seekers. That's impossible. Can't be done, you know. Um, so yeah, it's as simple as that, really. And and if you are a person that's coming to True Seek, because we don't know that you faked your shit in the past, we find out about it. We won't, we won't just boot you out straight away, but we are going to interview you about it quite heavily. You know, like you know, what are they talking about? Why are people thinking you're a fake? You know, etc. And you'll probably be watched quite heavily as well. But the point is, uh, we're going to try and go towards giving you better evidence on what True Seek is about, and. Um, you know, unedited videos, things like that. More push towards that path now because it's gotten crazy and it's just not, it's not worth it. It's not my, you know, it's, it's not my jurisdiction anymore. I can't, like I said, I can't save everybody's money. I can't do it. I've tried, and I was only start because I was so pissed off and everything. And wifey looks like she's coming up the stairs to dust the stairs, so I'm gonna have to go in a minute, I think. But you get the gist. It's like the longest cigarette ever. Um, so yeah, so maybe later I'll do your spirit box session. Maybe I upload that one from Sunday. Uh, it wasn't great, 
but um, like I said, we were woken up to a, a noise that can only be described as someone touching the porcelain face of a doll, very porcelain china sounding. It was quite fucking loud as well. Uh, we did a spirit box session. It, I didn't really hear much on it at all, but you know, uh, maybe you will. We'll see. So that's about it, really. Thank you for watching. Thank you for all your support and all that. It's amazing. Uh, thank you for reporting the video. Uh, many, many people have reported that video over and over again with my address on it. And again, I don't even want them to take down the video. All I want to do is just take down the address. You can make as many videos of me as you want. Give me the exposure. I don't give a fuck. It makes a difference to me. It really, really doesn't. Um, so yeah, we'll work it out like that and where we're going to go from there, really. So um, I'll catch you soon, Furtless. And... Um, yeah, watch Truth Seekers grow, watch Truth Seekers be totally respected for, for what it is, and it is a, a little elite community where only decent evidence is going to sit. Uh, I'm so glad that um, I've, this is the reason why I got the moderators, uh, Proven Demons and Jane, because I always, every opportunity I get, I fuck up in some way. It's just who I am. Like I said, that's maybe why I'm such a lovable character. They are doing the right thing, getting the direction going and where to go. And uh, I'll let them take control and take the rein on that. That's cool, no worries, you know. That's why I had them as moderators, you know. Um, so, yeah, and look out for Death Seekers, because, like I said, you're not going to get Order of Magnitude's persona on there. What you are going to get is hopefully some wicked evidence. If you want to get a clue as to what Death Seekers might be like, if you haven't watched it already, I know a lot of you have, but if you haven't got a clue what the hell I'm talking about, Obviously, you can search Death Seekers, but I'm not in it yet because we're still doing. They're still doing the editing for the Bob in Jail because I wasn't in it at the very, very start. Um, go to Paranormal X uh, and type in Paranormal X and order. Type that, and you'll see my mug on the front with uh, Mark and Simon with our little Holy Grails. We caught some really good stuff, and we were, you know, we were really professional in that forest, and that's, you know, sort of what we do, you know. So it's sort of going to be a bit like that. Just imagine. Jane and Proven Demons were with us that night as well, and you'd have got Death Seekers basically. So, yeah, simple as that, really. How long have I been doing now? Another seven minutes. Oh, God. I hope all this makes sense to you. Uh, I hope, I know a lot of you do enjoy Oom the Bastard Demon with his little education, but I still might, still might do a, a, an Oom video here and there. Um, <laughs> if he ever turns up again, because he hates order of magnitude, I'm sure you know it, it, that hate will be directed inwards towards him a bit, <laughs> as usual. So Oom will show up, and and of course Oom is a great person for giving you tips on marketing. What apps are real? What apps are not real? We've done all that, haven't we? You know, so simple's really. I'll leave it at that. But as far as uh, exposing fakes, if they're not in truth seekers then it's not my jurisdiction anymore, I won't be policing it, so to say. The paranormal police. <laughs> Thanks, wise one. I do like that. And uh, thank you, Mark Davies, for calling me the uh, saviour of the paranormal. Very good. Come on, come on. I look anything like the saviour of the paranormal. Just a, just a guy. Just a guy that lived in a house for eight, you know, with eight years worth of activity. Been here ten, two years, not much. You've heard all this on the last video. So yeah, but those of you that are wondering if I'm okay, like are you upset or whatever, that's absolutely fine. Like I said, I, I dare you to come to this house with the way my wife is at home. She'll fucking tear you a new asshole, I swear. I won't have to do anything, I'll just stand back and go, fuck, you know, I'll be rather you than me, mate. Seriously, rather you than me. So there you go. And, uh, you know, that's about it, really. What can I say? If you've got any questions or anything like that, Put them in the comments, uh, but like I said, uh, I've summarised, haven't I, how I'll be answering slimy furthuses and, and uh, you know, whatnot. I think i said everything. I'm just trying to make sure I've said everything. I'm very clear on it. I know it's probably going on like, fucking hell, order, shut the fuck up. I just want to go now. <laughs> yeah, you can go now. You're, you're safe to go. And um, like I said, I might upload that spirit box session later on if you're lucky. We'll see. It's not that good, really, but every, you know. I'm going to upload all of them in, no matter what. That was my ethos. Marilyn Manson's playing now. Yeah, she got some good taste in shoes, doesn't she, old Mrs. Magnitude? Um, regarding her as well, yes, she'll make a comeback here and there, but audio. I don't think she's ever going to do a live stream, guys. I don't think she's ever going to do one. That's probably out the window. If you ever do, you're going to be very, very lucky. Hey, anyway, guys, take care.
and I'll see you uh, probably tomorrow or today. Like I say, thank you for all your support, you've been awesome. And uh, to the fakers out there, you're free. You're free to do what you want. Sell some dolls, sell some portals, sell. You're free. It's okay. Orders not to come in after you, so to say. I was never coming after you anyway, I was just telling people what. <laughs> what have I got? A thousand subscribers under? Really? You know, it's not going to make a dent, is it really? But, um. Yeah, that's it, you know? The only people that matter now are in Truth Seekers. They're the things I'll concentrate on, they're the things that are important. And uh, I'll look after that group as best I can. And uh, I can't do it all on my own, hence why well, I've got the moderators, Proving Demons and Jane. And Grub Paranormal, sorry Grub, I nearly forgot you there as well. She's, because she's American, obviously she's going to be up at certain times, English people are asleep, Grub will be awake, and you know. But yeah, if you've got um, some something you've caught, this is another thing I want to address as well. It, um, if you're new to this, and you have caught something on your camera or whatever, and you're interested, don't be scared to go to Truth Seekers and go, look, I, I've caught this, but I don't know what it is. Because you won't be going, ah, fake. Or, no, if we find or we think we found a rational explanation for it, we'll tell you. But when you're not going to be outed as a fake because you caught something, you don't know what it is. There's a difference. Um, the lady that we kicked out, Angela, she's meant to be, have done this for 21 years and, and is a medium and, and has client uh, and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? So she should really know what she's doing by now. That, that, that's my point. Yeah, but you know, that's the difference. So don't be scared to come to us if you're new to this. You think you caught something, but you're unsure. Chances are it might be just something rational, or you might have caught something really cool. Don't be scared to come to us and show us, all right? That's another thing I want to address because, you know, this stuff does exist, I promise you. Don't. I know there's so many fakes out there, there are fucking loads of them, and they all want your money or your attention or whatever the reason might be. Cash usually, because if it's fake and there's nothing for sale, is the channel monetized? Views equals cash, you know what I'm saying? Um, all I can do is educate you that way, without exposing no more, you know? But don't be put off, this stuff does exist, I promise you. I've seen it first hand, I've had eight, eight years with it, my wife ten. It, you know, if it was just like one or two, maybe three up to ten events, maybe there's coincidences, but come on. You cannot tell me eight years worth of events is just coincidence. Uh, and other people who were here, it wasn't just me who viewed it, my wife, but people who have stayed in the house have viewed things. Uh, we had one guy who's my wife's brother, he didn't believe in none of this shit. And he's like, no, I don't believe it, I don't believe it, I don't believe it, I don't believe it. By the end of the night, we found him at the bottom of our bed, clinging to our bed. We're like, what are you doing? Nothing. Um, um, why are you up here? Like, you know, what? what? Oh, I, j I just got a bit worried. Like, you know, what? what you, you experienced something last night, did you? No, 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 no. no. <laughs> it fucks with your head when you have an experience. It really does. Especially if you don't believe this shit. It fucks with your head. You think, no, it can't. You double take, you know? <laughs> Is this shit happening? Yeah, 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 it's happening. And when it happens over and over again, then you'll understand. So I promise you. This stuff does exist, it really does, and uh, I try and document what I can from here on in. Maybe I should have gone, come out with it, maybe we should have gone on 12th hour. We should have done, maybe, but we would. We have to think of our family first. We didn't want to be a tourist attraction, and we didn't want to be called fakers either, you know, just because some people will never believe, no matter how. That's up to them. The only reason why they don't believe is because they haven't had a, an experience, and that makes perfect sense, because I never believed it either, as I said. I am a sceptic from the hardest of adepts turned shit, this stuff exists. So, I'm testament to that, okay? That's it for this. I think... Yeah, another 15 minutes of really the shite is done. Enjoy yourself. Uh, Christmas is coming soon. It's all good. Up and out from here. There'll be no more retaliation or any communication from any morons and slimy furnaces. Adults. The only thing I ask of Mark Davies and people, keep your videos up of me, do as many as you like. Lovely. I won't be retaliating to him though. But could you just please, please ask you nicely before like, the police come here this afternoon and I have to file a report. Please just change the address on it. That's all I ask you. Delete your keep the rest up. That's fine. But you take away the address. You can even put slanderous things that I'm on benefits and he's sick. Because I'm not. You can go and call up if you want and find out if I'm on the sick. I think you'll find I'm not on the sick. Because I'm not sick. Medication does not mean you're sick necessarily, you just need medication to, to survive and function. It's nothing to do with being sick, is it? You know, I, I'm, I'm capable and I'm self employed if you like, and uh, my wife works part time. We're not on any benefits per se, so no one's frauding anything on that front. And um, 
At least I was using my kid for money as well. I don't know. Uh, like I said, not 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 even going to go down that route. We'll just leave it at that. This is a pure knee-jerk reaction thing. And like I said, I'd be pissed too if someone destroyed my possible income for next year if I was selling stock. But it's one of those things. But there you go, Chris. You also got your half apology, if you like. Or you got your facts straightened out. It was not Chris that pulled the string on a clock. It was Angelo who was on Chris's team. There you go. All right. And that is it. Bump. Exposed is done. I can't police it no more. That is it. The line is drawn right on this second. The only jurisdiction I will have will be in Truth Seekers. That's it. And I would like to concentrate on the evidence uh, and bringing you good stuff. And I'd also want to hopefully get some good YouTubers that are in here that haven't got an audience who have got some cool, cool stuff. I'd love them to come in. I really, really would. Take care, Furless, and um, adios. Peace, love, empathy. I don't want to say happy Christmas because it's not really Christmas yet, but it's very getting close. And uh, yeah, looking forward to the spirit rock sessions and the usual shit I put up in the vlogs, I expect. Take care, bye bye.